Okay, uh, as a bonus action, I shall give the Carl a bardic inspiration. I touch him on the shoulder and say, Don't fuck up. And I end my turn. Okay. Um, okay. The, the funny part is, for Camille, you seem to, to notice this is turning into something like Sesame Street. <laughs> you have no idea what the thing is. You have a frog and you have a, a, a count. <laughs> so many <laughs> yeah, I half expect to see a yellow bird that's quite big <laughs> soon, appearing soon. Uh, and then since we're in ice, right? So expect a mammoth. Somebody's <laughs> 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 just laughing like, like no business. <laughs> Okay, anyway. <coughs> Alright, so. The frog. Will jump. Wait, before that, uh, spiritual yeah, guardian. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, spiritual oh. guardian. Okay, so. Spiritual, okay, what does it do? Okay, um. It is to make a saving throw, wisdom saving throw. Wisdom saving throw. Let's see whether his wisdom will prevail again. Oh god, no. DC, oh no. DC was what? DC 17. 17, so it fails. Yes. Okay. So what damage was it again? Um, 15. Wait, 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 is it? Click it. Click it and pop it up. Yeah, it's 15. 15, what? I don't... You need it to roll. You click on the show spell description on your spell. I need to reroll or you need yeah. like just... No, no. Uh, go up on the chat and click show description so we can see what... Yeah. Oh, 15 feet. Blah, blah, blah. Then 3d8 radiant damage. So on the fail safe, you have to... Yeah, roll 3d8. So far, radiant, I think. Oh, okay. It's our first talk. Oh, crap. <clears throat> pew, 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 pew. It doesn't get the stick. Yeah, he got hit by the spirit guardians. That wallop it mercilessly. Uh, I, thought, I, thought, I thought he needed to do a save, right? He did, he failed. He did? Yeah, failed. Because oh. in DC, DC, DC 17, 17 he rolled a 16. It's wise, but not so wise now. Mm. <laughs> Alright, so... Okay, at the same time, it managed to leap 20 feet. Holy crap. Boom. <laughs> and... It tries to do this. Swallow? Oh. Yep, so I'll hold something. The knight or... Chen? Chen. Oh. He senses all of the misery and pain comes from Chen. <laughs> it is wise. It has proven itself to be wise. <laughs> oh, God. Oh. It misses, right? It uh, misses. Swallow attack, yeah. yes. 11 miss. Yep. Chen. Cool aura. Alright. One to ten, right? Wait, is it at the beginning or the end? Any creature that starts its turn within ten feet. Ah, okay. Start its turn, alright. So wait. Oh my god. No. So previously wow. the knight when he came in, at the end of that turn, he got the what? Four ah, damage? Yeah, he well, it started to be at the at beginning of his turn. Mm, okay. He is within ten feet. He just went closer. Mm. Ooh, nine. Nine, that's bad. Ooh, Ooh chile. Yep. <coughs> uh, 
So GM? No, yep. it's Chen's turn now. Yeah, sorry. Yep. Oh, ah, wait, you got damage, right? So that means the e concentration? No? Yeah, you have to stay uh, low for concentrations. So it's 1d20, right? What save for for the concentration stuff? I don't know. Concentration up to 10 minutes. Okay, concentration. Is it con save or what? Let me see if I can find anything. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Concentration concentration save is not con save, it's concentration save. Huh? It's its own save. Huh? So basically, we roll 1d20 then. Hmm. Yeah. So Maybe so basically, you either do a DC ten or yeah, you you you're, you're safe. It's either DC ten or half the damage you take. So whichever is higher. So the uh, the spell is safe, right? Yep, yep. As long as you roll ten and above, So it's it's Your circle seems to wobble for a bit, and it stays. Oh no! Remember, you have inspiration. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, anything so else? So what is the creation desk? 1d6. Only uh, you. For him, it's 1d8. Only one you. Alright. So I need to roll 1d8? No, 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 no. If you want to add no, no, no. anything. <laughs> it's like an extra bonus. If you yeah, need. it depends on you. Okay. Because I know that it has been all the dead. So, when we tell this is, all right, yeah. So that's the nicest one. Nine. Nine, so the dead. By the way, I'm reading up on the rules. It says, uh, you take damage and fail a constitution saving throw to maintain your concentration. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, really? Yeah, content. And expect me But the DC would be 10 or plus half the damage. Uh, 10 or half the damage. So the damage is yeah. 9, so half of 9 is... No, 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 no. If the damage is higher than 10, oh. plus half the damage. Oh. Yeah, so 10 plus half the damage is higher than 10. <clears throat> All the date. So it needs to do a wisdom saving throw of 17. But why is it you roll but, for attack? Okay, you roll a, a 9, right? 9 for yeah. the damage. 18 for the concentration. No, I think Pull the date doesn't need a attack roll. Okay. Yeah. yeah. The stats weird because it roll for attack. Wait, uh, no. wait, wait, does it say for the, oh, the top bar here? Okay, uh, okay actually, actually here, 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 oh, give me a second, huh? Mm -hmm. The point yeah. it doesn't have to attack, right? Okay, so, so, so here's the thing, you're at fifth level, so it do 2d8 damage, or yeah. 2, 2d8. Yeah, but uh, 2d12 damage, because uh, it's already been injured. So, so, so you need to roll another d12, I guess. Not too sure. It's already right. one. It's one d twelve, so it rolls max twelve. So yeah. So he needs to draw another d twelve. Why? Because it's two d twelve when he's double five. No, you level. can see the calculation already. Oh, it's single d twelve. Yeah. yeah. So this, they need to two d twelve. So you need to roll another d twelve. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Roll another d twelve. So it's a three. So fifteen. Okay. It's a DC seventeen, right? Yep. 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 Okay. On wisdom. Let's see if it's wisdom all Ah. Nope. Oh, ding dong. Fifteen. And he got hit. Don't. Not so wise anymore. Ah. But it, it lets out a loud, loud croak. Wow. And... Oh, another two. I think. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna eat That's my turn. Almost here, uh, something else crop back. Mm. The knight. Oh. So, 1d10, please? Yes. Four. 
Four. Fuck. Cool. Storage. <laughs> Die, foul beast. Bother us no longer. Wow. Seven. Oops. Misses. Bloody hell. Try again. Twenty-one. Boom. Six. Flanking? No, yes. Oh yeah, you are flanking. But does the rule apply in this game? No. No. If I apply flanking, you guys will be flanked. <laughs> or <laughs> before. Or if we play flank. Flank before. Yeah, we play Kong conga line. <laughs> conga line of doom. If you play flanking, you guys have been flanked many, many times before. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so, yes. Right. The frog gets six points of damage. Yes. So now it's Camille's turn. Seeing the frog getting damage, wanting some glory, I shoot. Ah, it oh, well. Good thing it's not a one. <laughs> Where is he? Here, somewhere. You, you, okay. ah, you wonder point. how you can miss such a large foe. Oh no! It's another oh, one! I something. something jumped! And straight into view! Alright. Your turn, Kao. Okay, okay. Right. Let's do it. It's Eldritch Blast time. You mean morphing time? Mm, that, that that's another guy's uh, role. Give me. <laughs> <Not mine. laughs> oh, <come on. laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, that ain't there. That ain't there, no. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. It's, it's not. It's not morphing for me. So it so hits twice. You are attacking the injured one, right? Oh yeah, attacking the injured. All right. Oh sure. shit, that's a lot of <laughs> Alright. <sighs> the first one hits. And call it. Oh, okay. Uh, Eldritch energy pierces through its uh, body. No? And it lays flat. Flat into the pond. Power of water. Right. Holy crap, there's actually two more. Yes. There's I'm... always been two more. Now they just appear in the map. Final of... Cow. Give me a second. Uh, yeah. So what about the second one? Uh, gonna move back. Uh, okay, that's it. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> so another faster two than me. Boom. Good boy. Holy cow. Okay. Okay, looking at the situation. Hello. This is this is bad. No, not yet. I want to read this spell first. No, not yet. Ha, ah, alright. Looking at the situation right now, I see there's two frogs in front of me and a knight there. Um Hmm. I am going to Let's see. So I'll uh, use twenty five feet to move here. Okay. Then I got a view of them. Kind of boys. Um and I will ready action. Uh, ready action, taking out my crossbow bolt, and yeah, uh, if anything happens to appear in front of the knight or Chen Chen, I will shoot it, and I end my turn. Okay, this is going already. Go to that. Wait, why is it still there? Okay, Chen. 
Then gonna move like here. Oh wait, what? Really? Yep. Wow. Okay. No one else to do. <laughs> oh yeah, you you gotta back up your night friend. Yep, yep. Yeah. How? Your circle of spirit guardians will follow you, right? Yes. Yep. Okay. And ten gonna spiritual weapon. No, uh, I have to. I will what can I do? Meditate. Oh. <laughs> I will try to use. This is weird. Okay. Wait. Wait. Uh. <coughs> Oh, yeah, I can do that. Right. I'm gonna use my Thorn Whip. Thorn Whip, nice. You create a I long vine like whip covering in thorn, covering thorn splash out at the command towards creature in range, making a range spell attack against the target. If target attack hits, the creature take on the increasing damage and if the creature is large or smaller, you put the creature up to 10 feet closer to you. Huh. Okay. So... Oh. It's a large creature. So he hits for 17 and then it takes 13 piercing damage and then what? If it hits, another 1d8? That's it? Make a range spell attack against the target if the attack hits. The creature takes damage. Okay, so uh, extra 1d8. Alright. Alright, so it hits. It pulls about 10 feet closer to you, right? Yep. Okay. Oh, uh, my thing triggers. <laughs> You're really trying to pull it close to you. That's what I was thinking. Oh no. <laughs> my thing doesn't hit that far. Oh no. Uh, any shot will be at what disadvantage. Is... No, I'm gonna ignore it then. <laughs> <laughs> I think, yeah. That's my turn. Uh, but it takes 13 piercing damage. Ding, 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 ding. Yep. Yes. Yes, take a damage. And then I'm gonna... my turn. Okay, okay. Now it's Morbius time. Ah, uh, what is Morbius gonna do? He's is he going. gonna rest? Is he going to save a day? No. Like in the movie? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Which is more creepy? Your movie sucks! <laughs> is, he, is he gonna fly? <laughs> you have made me more be. <laughs> you don't I'll like me. That and then. Alright, I'll cut. Uh, Bean on both of them. Uh, Bean, oh. Oh, oh sorry, only one can hit 30 feet on me. Up to three creatures of your choice, okay. So the two that I saw at uh, the south. This one? Mm, yep. That's the only thing that he can hit. That's the only thirty feet for me. Alright. I'll pass the turn. So, uh, Bane, uh, up to three creatures you can... Uh, must, uh, up to three creatures of your choice that Sea must make a Charisma saving throw. Whenever a target that fails its saving throw makes an attack roll, or a saving throw before the spell ends, the target must roll a 1d4. Oh yeah, he has to number. make a charisma saving throw first before the being takes his side. D14. It's not okay. charis charismatic like his cousin, Kermit. Kermit <laughs> is much better. Everybody loves Kermit. <laughs> yeah, saving throw is only 5. <laughs> charisma. It's not easy being blue. <laughs> 
Now it's the knight's turn. All right. So the knight will just do his hack and slash. For the honor of uh, seven. For the, the honor. honor of Grace. Ah, uh, cool. I mean, okay. No. Oh, no, no. First, he has to do one d one d ten. ten. First. Yeah. Yes. First, cool. Yep. The second one did the damage for slashing. Watching ten damage. Burp, burp. Mm-hmm. That's it. Camille. Verify. Huh? Is it in range? You're all right. Oh yeah. Ah, uh, sixty, right? Ah, oh, cool. You can get them both. Nice. Verifier, 60 feet, 20 foot cube. 20 foot cube. So yeah, it hits both. Oh no! Just the one, sir! Oh, this one? Okay. <laughs> Just the one. Okay. And then, uh, DC 15. Uh, or oh, what? What save was it? DC. Again? Dex. Dex, yes. Save. Dex. That one is also save. 15. Yep, it's... Which one? This one? Yeah, this that one 15 and this one is 20. Ooh! The fast. That's first. They jump up. Very bit. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. You will attempt to solo. Uh, make a wisdom save first. Yep, yep. To this. They're also wise. The wise, the wise. Ah, no, nope, okay. not wise. Not wise. Okay. Enough. Yep. Roll for damage. It's three, three D eight. What? Why is the roll? <laughs> three D eight, right? I think yeah. Roll twenty four. Ah, oh. well, close enough. Fifteen. <laughs> Fifteen, that's a lot of damage. Yeah, it is. Alright. Nonetheless, this will try to solo Chen. What solo you mean? Oh, shoot, Ooh. that's fine. Sorry, uh, your, your AC is fifth. Ah, yes. Yeah, um... Camille's much better because he is a D8, if I'm not mistaken, right? Yeah, he's a full fledged, but unlike you. Hey, I'm getting my yeah. way there, man. Ooh. I'm getting my way there. Ooh, seven! Oh, that's very cutting. Yeah, but does it, is it enough to cut 22? That should be uh, enough. 17, yeah. enough. Uh-huh. Yours is 15, 14, right? You know, uh, his DC is. Uh, oh, uh, 17, DC yeah. Is 15. 17, yes, Bakau. Yeah. Bakau no. <laughs> so, Carl, uh, Camille, what do you say to the frog? Makobiru. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so it doesn't, uh, it doesn't manage to swallow. Mm. Alright, Carl, you're good then. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Come on, fearless, fearless leader. Yeah, fearless leader is thinking. How 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 can I best help you? Okay, let's go here. Uh, you know what? No, 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 no. Let's, let's not go there. Okay, I'm gonna shoot at this thing. <coughs> Try to push him out of the way. You know, I mean, uh, as a player suggestion, shooting this one with Eldritch, um, sorry, shooting this one with Eldritch Blast, if it hits twice, it moves 20 feet away. So that means our players here would be safe from the chill attack. Technically, yes, but, you know, the, the other frog will be able to move in. Mm, true. Alright. Just so, suggesting, so the, just suggesting. So, so the next one should be this one. He hasn't moved yet, so this is the better target. Because okay. if you move the guy, then this guy can just jump in. Then they'll be able to mm, do uh, another true, attack. True, 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 true. 
Alright. So if we do this, it'll be a bit harder for me to attack this. Okay. I will use Bardic Inspiration, D8, right? No, I don't think Bardic Inspiration lasts. It only lasts for one round, right? It's the, the second round. I think the second or third, uh, second round. Wait, 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 let me check. Bardic Inspiration. Bardic. Yeah, second. There you go. Uh, We win the text anyway, yeah, so it's there, uh, 1d6 for me. So 12, does it hit, GM? T. It doesn't. Oh, oh, damn. So it's higher than 12. Yeah, but the second one does, right? C. Yep, the second one does. Okay, push him back. Uh, 10, 10 feet. feet. Push him push okay. first, 10 feet. No, no, he, he, he's going to go... Oh yeah, he's going to go there. Yep. Yep. Push him, push him. And I'm done. My turn. Alright. Now it's his turn. Okay. He jumps 20 feet. Boom. <laughs> he jumps on top of another rock? Side by side. Or you want to prefer it jumps on the players? Nope. Oh no. <laughs> it, it is huge. Uh, there is an option to, to have that crushing blow. <laughs> no. uh, but that uh, means the player needs to do a scary. dex saving throw, right? Yeah. Yep. Uh, need. Come on. Spirit Guardian in fact. Yeah. He moved into the area. Oh yeah. So the spiritual guardian effect. So now it's what? Uh, wisdom saving throw of DC 17, was it? Yes. Yeah, 17. <laughs> on the dot. Ooh, this one's right? smart. This one's smart. So smart. So saw it. Yep. Just jump directly over the spirit. <laughs> Swallowing? Uh, Him? Or? The spirit takes half damage, right? Even yeah, yeah. Take. On the oh. table, you take half damage. Oh, okay. So, 3d8. If I'm not mistaken, the damage. 3d8. So, it's still Six, six, yeah. six, six, four, 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 four. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, six. Oh no, that's not good. Four, 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 four. In Chinese. <laughs> Roulette. And then for the swallow, it has to roll a d4 and minus from uh, the attack roll. It's attacking. Sorry, uh, oh. it's attacking Chen. Chen. Uh, misses. Because uh, Chen's AC is six seventeen. Yeah, yeah, but every attack it makes have to roll a d4 ah, to... Ah, yeah. that's your bane. Yeah, that's your bane. Mm -hmm. Sorry, also, every... Sorry, uh, I have to remind everyone, because every attack right now is at advantage. Ooh. Because oh, they're RGB mode. They, I, thought, I thought they saved it. No, they, if I remember right... Who's verifier? Your verifier. No, it, it's verifier right. the first one, right? This is the second verifier. Yeah, second. yeah, the second one. The verifier, okay. Verifier, didn't they save it? Did they? Yeah. They save? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, GM, this box can go away. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Second, second verifier. <laughs> that was the second verifier. No, no, third one. Okay. <laughs> spell slot, baby. He needs to save his spell slot for something else. What? What spell slot? <laughs> Oh boy. <clears throat> so anywho, now it's uh the frog's turn. Yep. And it I think it's it has and tried to swallow and fail. Swallow fail. Yes. Mm -hmm. Was it? All right. So it's my turn now. Ah, this is going to be fun. Thirty five feet. Okay, I'll move five here. Checking my situation surroundings. Oh no, that, that's bad. No. So I'll move here instead. Alright, so... Wait, isn't that blocking? Oh god. I'll move one step front. Oh god. Can I shoot from this point of view? Okay, you know what? Uh, since I have advantage, that's good. Um, I have advantage on attack. I think attack triggers. Pulling out my hand crossbow and I'm shooting this frog. Let's go. 23. 
a total of 16 points of damage. Are you sneaky? Yes. There's uh, Because I have advantage. And... No, the, you have advantage, but where does the sneak come from? Uh, because of my... Uh, cunning action. No, sorry, uh, what was it again? Was when, the... when did you ever sneak? <laughs> uh, this, no, no, no this for card. a rope at a level one. At level, one level uh, if the target is near another uh, ally that is attacking, within five feet, uh, if I'm not mistaken, the rope can get an advantage of the attack. Yeah, there we go. There's... Within five feet. Okay, where is the five feet? Oh, ally? Um, ally. Toward Tenchen. Okay. This guy, this guy, they're in, they're in range. Okay, sure. So 16, right? Yes. Okay, call it. Oh, um, as I aim and shoot, it whizzes past through Chen Chen and the knight and hits the frog right dead in the middle between the eyes and it gets pushed back, I think. <laughs> That's how I think it would. <laughs> uh, it doesn't, it's so, it's so heavy, it just plop, bloop. And I, <laughs> and I say to him, it's not easy being blue. <laughs> That's bad. And <laughs> I get my turn. <laughs> All right. Chen, you begin and you roll a 1d10. Oh, 1d10. All right. Why am I running so good even for damage on myself? <laughs> okay. And then uh, you have to... Check concentration, right? Yep. Okay. So that means 10 or higher. 10 or higher, right? 11? Shit. Uh, you have to roll a <laughs> con save. Oh yeah, it's a concentration save. You have inspiration. What was it again? Constitution or... Oh man, I just... Con it's like constitution save, like... Yeah, concentration is a concept. Concentration. So, it's the concept. Concentration. Yeah, on your saving throws, put on concentration. So, oh. Oh. Save. You are damaged, but you are scared. <laughs> Alright, so, do your action now. So healthy clearly, but getting the cool. Ah, uh, you, no. you need to okay. grow fur to get acclimated to the cold. Later on, I will grow some fur. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, clearly, our player wants to be a werewolf. Meow. <laughs> Meow. <laughs> Become a what a wolf? Okay, what a wolf hybrid. Does it hit? Target must make a. Is it damage? Not right. What's that? Must. EC seventeen wisdom. Ah. It fails, so it takes twelve. Sorry, 1d8 damage if the target is missing any of its points is 1d12 instead at oh. higher level, so it's 12. Yeah, so, so you roll another d12. Uh. So you, yeah. you need to take a start, yeah. Just roll another d12. Oh yeah, it's counting it twice. So Does basically... Does the take damage previously? Yeah, yeah. because yeah, yeah. Uh, of... From... Oh, okay. because roll of... another d12, d huh? Roll another d12, yeah. But damn, Chen Chen lucky. That's two. 15 yeah, total four, damage. Two. <laughs> Not so lucky anymore. <laughs> it was a 12 and a 2. <laughs> Average out, man. <laughs> right? Yeah, I think that 
That's all for my turn. Morbius. Just to wait. Give me something. All right. Oh, okay, okay. So, what does the mighty Morbius do? Pointing my hand towards the prop type thingy, then cast Toll the Dead. Hold the dead. Yeah, it's it's a spell that warlocks have. Right? I yeah. just I just didn't take it. No, because I'm thinking like did I see it? Yeah, Chen Chen has it too. I I know the spell that Chen Chen did. So yeah, warlock warlocks warlocks have it. Also That's have why it. I recreate it again. <laughs> recreate so we didn't see. Fourteen. Ah uh, yeah, fourteen. We see fourteen. The challenge now oh, wow. is this fox smart or not? Oh, the fifteen. I was going to say how many? Fourteen. Yep. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Where's the point? Is it? Ah, mm, it's not. Stupid. All right. Two D twelve. Ah, ten. Ten. Rub it. Rub it. All right. Yes, and my turn. Okay, sure. It's the knight's turn. Uh, one nah, d ten. One d ten. Are you cold? Three. Ah, boom. Oh god, the stories he will be telling the marshal. <laughs> oh, missed. I'm getting cold. Fingers. Second, Freezing. Second attack always hits. Yeah. yeah. Alright. And he will end his turn. Camille, it's your turn. What do you do? Vicious mockery. DC fifteen. What DC do you fi say to it? DC fifteen. Eleven. It hits. <laughs> uh, it takes. Like, what was it again? Yeah, at, at uh, the certain stage, I'm starting to pity the frog. No. He's, he's been, he's, he has been doing his wisdom saving throw. <laughs> he's not smart. Call he, it. Oh, <laughs> he's not wise. He's mm, not wise. Kata o oh, kata, kenapa engkau hodo? KO! Emotional damage! <laughs> Wow, matikata. that was something else. Yeah, that's a term for matikata. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, you guys emerge victorious and yet affected. Yay, we can have five frog, frog licks for dinner. Haram. <laughs> oh that, that came out of nowhere. Alright, so you emerge victorious and you have three cartridges from. What is that? Oh, okay. <laughs> Carl, what do we do? I have no idea. GM, it's, yeah, let, me, let me do something. Based on my adventure knowledge, is the frog worth anything? Anything to salvage it? Well, you seem to, uh, to be familiar with the frog. 
it's a sense of deja vu that you have encountered frogs before. Oh, okay. So yeah, the frogs are pretty good, especially when they are cooked. They are very tasty. We should, you know, we should uh, come for them later on. Can you seem to be, to remember being chased by frogs? <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I remember having three girls become my bait, but I killed them. Yeah. You and your girls. So anywho, um, well, they ain't going nowhere, and the cold here. How is the cold? Is it chilly or is it getting back to quote unquote normal? It's just uh, chilly. It's just a normal winter cold Chill. now. So before that, it was deathly cool. So it's because of them, all right? Okay, we got. We just need the rest to heal up, or we um, be, be okay. I, to I, I think we're all good. Um, let's just explore the place. Try to find that hooded guy or something, and we we can head out. Uh, we can tell the dwarves that we found two of their companions. In the ice, so we need explanation on that. And other than that, I guess we just find more bodies then. Okay. Uh, um, Mister Vampire Sun, what are you doing here? Uh, what I is uh, what is Morbius investigating? The ice. The ice here. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh. Seems to be like uh, two people. Well, it's frozen solid. What aspect are you looking at? Uh, frozen solid, as in the top layer, or is it throughout the whole bundle? Well, it seems to be from the corpse that you can see from up from up there. It seems like they are frozen up to the bottom. And then I'll check if it's an arcane nature. No idea. No idea. Uh, while walking around, I'll take my crowbar and tap the ground to feel any soft point or anything like that. And also, do I have a broom? No, I don't. <laughs> so yeah, wh- oh, why, 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 who knows? I can be the cleaner. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so well, yeah. You you said this area is a bit uh in disarray, and the uh, the barrels are left topsy turvy. So yeah. anywho, um, while tapping on the ground, um, you know what? Uh, every fifteen feet of movement, I'll make a perception check just to see if there's any more of this. Okay. Yeah, any more of this. Okay. So starting from here, perception. Mm-hmm. Anything in front of me, no? No. All right. What you see is what you get. Moving 15 feet more. Uh, oh, okay. Um, poke the ground. Well, it seems to be normal ground, it's no... Well, you try to see whether there's anything that can be... Uh, that can fall, crack and have you fall through. Seems to be none. None. So, no mm-hmm. no signs of a uh, hidden path of bodies or anything like that? Well, nothing that you can see. Okay. For Carl, it seems like you are a, in one corner that seems to be a bit secluded. <laughs> From dress, but so far you do not invest, you do not sense anything amiss. Hmm. Hmm. Mm, okay. It's like yeah. Actually, what, what was that? This is also another ice sculpture. The ice formation. Mm. Or... Uh, it is a uh, something like it's not ice. It is one of the smaller tapit. Um. Yep. Everything seems normal. Right. Doing it again. Project that. One thing that you notice, this area, you notice is is very clean. Hmm. So, uh, sweep the ground, see if there's bodies or not, nothing? Nothing. It's, but it looks like it's very clean as opposed to the other part of the 
this valley uh, yeah. seems to have yeah. things uh, throwing out, but this seems to be very clean. You're referring to in front of me and here? Yes. Alright. So, three more blocks. There's nothing that seems to be... Uh, uh, <coughs> well, there's no signs of any wooden things, blocks or anything. It's just clean. So, that strikes you as a bit interesting. Okay. Hmm. G GM, this area here is... Uh, what, what is it? Is it like a cave or something? Yeah, it seems to have an outcropping because you are in a valley. Um, behind you, uh, you saw these are part of the cliff walls. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. It's not. It's not the entrance or anything, right? No. Okay. Yeah. This one is here as well. These are just cliff walls, right? Yep. It's basically the starting here, right after here. Okay, Leona, you are. Uh, Doing a perception check there. Yeah, it was three okay. blocks bef before previously. Uh, okay. Doing it and then like, I'm getting tired of this. <laughs> okay. Alright. But I don't think so there's anything. Okay, so... Uh, again, this area is, is very, very clean. Other than one wooden uh, bench. Very clean. Huh. Um, if that's the case, I'm going to... On a general look, does the... Is the bench clean? No, the bench is untouched. The area surrounding is is clean. There's no bench. There's no tool. There's no nothing. And the bench itself is uh, untouched? Or untouched. It, oh, so basically, there's a bit of snow on it or just frost on it? Well, there seems to be from the last night's uh, light snow. There's a layer of it. Mm, okay. Carl, you are investigating that area, okay? Yep. Sorry. Also, it looks extremely clean. There's nothing. There's nothing odd, right? What? There's, there's nothing odd about it. Or is there like cracks or marks or anything? Here's the thing that you do not see any tracks. You do not see any anything that other than the stream here. Okay. So far, nothing. It's just that it's very, very clean. The barrel itself is bar empty or filled with tar? It's half filled. Half this filled. is where I um, they are trying to start pouring tar into the barrels. Okay. So, move here. Is this an entrance to somewhere? Uh, no, it's just uh, surrounded by walls, the, the canyon walls. Alright, uh, I meet up with Carl and us. You found anything back there? Mm, no, but just that this place is really clean, I guess. Yeah, the, lower half is, the lower half is totally clean. There's no trees, no nothing. Uh, which is odd, but yeah. Mm, yeah, I mean, uh, explore a bit. And didn't found anything except this area is clean. Like it's been, well, let's just say there's no tool, there's no nothing, and it seems that nobody's been passing <laughs> by here. So that means that whatever it is, it's been clean for a while. Like it's untouched for a while, and there's nothing of significance. The barrels over there, they're Kind of half full. That's pretty odd. Um, yeah. And they say that there was, there was supposed to be a rope figure that came here? Yeah, um, there's also what? Um, yeah, rope figure, something like that. And I don't see. Also, they did mention that there's kind of a passageway going down, right? Oh, there's nothing here. I'm going to explore for a bit more. Uh, I'll let you know what I found. Oh, fine. Okay. Alright. Oh, interesting. Okay, walking a bit. Um, Leona? Yo? Can you roll uh, a dexter dexterity saving throw? Ah, dex. Okay, nothing happened. 
Oh. Uh, okay. Oh. I was about <laughs> to press perception. Okay. So, put ground. <laughs> anything? Do, do I feel? Do I see anything? Okay. Oh, no, it's there. Okay. Call. Yep. Can you roll a perception check, please? Okay. Must it be perception? Can I be investigation? <laughs> sure. Whichever that you feel. Okay. Not my <laughs> perception. All right. The tar bubbling uh, near you seems to be a bit weird. How so? Um, it seems to be moving <coughs> weirdly. Okay. Here, here is it? Yes. Hey okay. yeah, guys, the tower here is a bit weird. Seems to be moving weirdly. Wow. That's so weird. I uh, tried to poke it with my spear. You have a spear? <laughs> You have I a spear? Know, wait, what, what item do you have? That gives a lot of weapon. Well, <laughs> just because I... Did, yeah, just because someone stole my hand axe. <laughs> doesn't mean I don't have any item. <laughs> no, you gave it to me. I Who didn't stole? give it to you. I borrowed it. You gave it to me. <laughs> you didn't ask me back. I love a bit. So, you have a spear? Really? Sorry? You, you, you have a spear? Yeah, I have a spear. Alright. Oak. It's part of my it's part of my starting kit. Like, it's just that right. just that they never came to any use it. You are you poking the the tar? Yeah, I'm poking the tar. All right. As you poke the tar, the tar started moving. Oh no! Ah! And everybody, <laughs> freeze and roll initiative. Oh god! <laughs> oh. Give me a second. Remember, highlight your uh, player icon and then click on initiative. Mm, okay, fourteen. Black pudding. Oh no. <laughs> okay. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not within range yet, right? <laughs> okay, let me try here. Uh, Eleven. Yeah. <coughs> hmm. Wait, GM rolls initiative for oh. for the night. The night, okay. So everybody has rule? Uh yes, uh double checking. Let's see, we got Morbius, we got me, we got Chen, we got Carl, we got Yep, uh it seems everybody has rule, yes. Alright. Start Chen, you are the first to go. Okay. We are all over the place right now. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? <laughs> For this round, Chen mm -hmm. gonna move. Chen gonna move a bit behind, like here. Mm -hmm. So you're the tank. Yeah, <laughs> you, you are the tank. <laughs> <laughs> and Chen gonna cast. Oh, I'm gonna cast. Uh, what do I have? You can move it and hit it. <laughs> what is I because I don't know what is that actually because I cannot see it. Oh oh. And I'm just gonna fire a crossbow bolt. How oh, big is it? Same size as the giant toad. Same size giant toad because from my point of view right now I only see pieces of it like it's almost in full cover. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, because uh, the GM had blackened out the target there. No, uh, also it's so uh, it's... my view. It's also my view. Like, uh, when you see the recording, you know what I mean? Alright. Like, yeah, it is... Yeah, I understand. Yeah, it is... Oh, no, <laughs> it is... Oh, a 21! Nice. Wait, uh, is it at advantage or disadvantage? It's still... It's not 5 feet, right? It's not, so it's not advantage. But the cover, it's um. I don't think it's the cover. It's oh. just a drop down to the topic. Oh okay. 
Red Gem. Yeah. GM is mute for a bit. Give it a second. Okay. Hey, um. As yeah, it's not covered. Well, but then again, as you notice, your crossbow bolt hitting the the moving black acorn. It seems to start melting and freezing, and it deteriorated yeah, into nothingness. No impact. It's a twenty-one. And uh, for Carl, you notice your spear, the tip of it, has corroded. Fuck. No physical attack. Fuck. Shit. Okay. Damn. Just, just the tip. Player to player, get naked because it is going to eat through your armor. I Not think really. also your flash mark. It's also true. <laughs> <laughs> and are you doing anything else? I don't. I'm gonna end my save. <laughs> All right. Okay. Uh, I I I I shot, I shot to the guy. Use use range weapons. <laughs> use range weapons. Damn question. How tall is the wall behind me? It's corrosive. Okay. It's about twenty feet high. And then there's a ledge on top of it. Yes. I climb, I climb to the top. Acrobatics. Parkour. Walk, oh, you walk briefly to the top. Wait, how? how You get spider climb? It's another one Ah, I do have spider climb. He has <laughs> vampire, no, he has Morbius climb. <laughs> Sorry, Just Morbius walk climb. walk briefly towards the top and then step on top. <laughs> okay. He's a vampire. <laughs> so that puts me <laughs> 20, 20 feet on top right above elevation. Yes. Uh, all right. First, I will do this. Bean? Mm, hex. So I attack the creature. You place a curse on a creature that you can see within range until the end of the Does the creature need to do any saving? Uh, I, uh, wait, uh, please as well until the end. Yep. No save. No save. <coughs> I just get an extra oh, one hit. Until the I spell mean. ends, meaning after you use this, uh, after you attack and hex uh, triggers, you need to recast it again? Mm, no need. The hex. If I'm left, I cut another concentration spell. Ah, okay. Or oh, I dispel it. Okay. Cool. Okay, uh, wait. It has disadvantage on uh, ability checks. I mean, mm -hmm. the chosen ability, what ability that I choose? Uh, hmm. I got no idea. Choose now, la. Strength, dexter, wisdom. Cast the spell. Okay. I'll choose automatic order. You know, um, wisdom does do well with uh, Chen Chen's spiritual guardian thing. Mm -hmm. So if it does go for Chen, it is very beneficial for Chen. And two, but I do not know that, right? No, I mean just but saying four players. I, 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 uh, yeah, true, true, true. Uh, let me read on some stuff. Uh, yeah, I'll just wisdom. Ability check, ability check. Ability meaning yeah. the standard check, uh, wisdom, uh, wisdom. Mm -hmm. Anything that we make a uh, ability check with wisdom, it has a disadvantage on it. Okay. And then I'll uh, cut. Uh, that is my bonus action. Oh, that's a bonus Ooh. action. Cool. Hex is bonus action. All right. Oh, this is. So this thing for frightened. Oh, okay. No, it's not frightened. frightened. No, it's not frightened. Oh, G I'm not looking for. I'm, I'm looking for that hex. Uh -huh. Ah, okay, okay. okay. What is hex? That's... I thought I was the one who can be frightened. Oh no, that's scary. <laughs> you. 
suit. <laughs> Ew, he's dirty got my clothes. Oh. <laughs> All this class. 14. Right. Does a 14 hit? It does hit. Then the last of boss with 7 damage hits it. Alright. And then our EOG. By the way, uh, does the arrow hit from Chen Chen? It does. It does. Alright, cool. So, hearing the commotion up there, I shall move as far as I can towards the troubles here. Okay, this would be good. Okay, so I'll move 30 feet forward. Anything happens, GM? Um, yeah, so far so good. Alright, because you did ask me to roll for a, what should we call this, uh, dex checklist now. Yeah. Oh, uh, no, I'm at think. level 5, so does the cantrip effect for level 5? Yeah, it should be. Edric Edric Plus. It should yeah. be. Yeah, so I have to actually uh, 2d10, because I'm at level 5. Okay. Your Eldritch Blast. Okay. No, no, wait, 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 you're doing Eldritch Blast, is it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wait, uh, you, you, need, you need to roll uh, separately. Because each, each Eldritch Blast needs yeah. its own, own roll. When I at level with a uh, separate blast. No, no, I'm not cutting it double. I'm not. His, uh, his damage. Oh, oh, two beams. Okay, okay, yeah. okay, okay. Oh. okay. Oh, so I need to roll twice, but that's a good advantage because Hex okay, was well, triggered. Uh, hold on. One thing, are you at the level five for your class? Nah. <laughs> he, he, he has to be on the class, huh? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So we <laughs> have a, we have a multi classer here. I see. <laughs> oh, Kanto <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. But 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 you didn't say that it needs to be level five in the class. You just said level yeah. five. Yeah. Level five, not in one lock. I, I, don't, uh, well, don't the thing, the thing, the thing is, it, it is a specialization. If true, true. you want to to have a really, the, let, let's say, you are a full um concentration and to to have that, let's say you are you are multi cluster, you are not a level five at one of the class. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. No, that because it's it's you have you have not given all the the full study and experience and the thought process and practice behind that. Mm -hmm. Also, when it uh, also on the character sheet, it just says level three something, level two something. So yeah. technically, you're not a full fledged. Uh, what you call this? Oh, actually, whatever actually, it is. Uh, Rich plus. Uh, it's a it's a skill that skills with the character level. It's not the warlock level. Really? So it's, yeah, it's a special thing for warlock. I think for cantrip, actually, for cantrips, yeah. for cantrips skill they, with the level they skill with the character level. level. No. Yeah. Really? Huh? Yeah. Um, I, I don't know. Again, DM discussion. Well, it, the character level, uh, also it has to be tied to the specialization for for the class. Let's say you you are a level five fighter, you cannot <laughs> by right, yeah. It doesn't. Okay, let let's just say you are a six level, you are five level fighter and one level sorcerer. Mm. So a cantrip, you cannot have that certain practice logically. Okay, to cast okay. it, yeah. Even though it's a cantrip, but you yeah, do not yeah. have the practice for that. You can, you can slice and dice people with impunity. That is awesome, true. Yeah. Okay. All right. So anywho, uh, for as for me, I shall give it emotional damage. Okay. Make it try. Find me a river. So DC 15 on Wisdom, and I call it, you are a menace to society. Nobody likes you. Wisdom, eh? All right. Is well, it a wise block? Oh, it is a wise block. <laughs> Sorry, no. Uh, it takes disadvantage on right? Wisdom save yeah. because of Hex. But it's also a pass because it's 15. No, no, but, 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 but you guys say, said before, right? Hex, Hex doesn't, doesn't affect saves. No. Yeah, uh, that's correct. Only abilities. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, this before. Okay, but still, uh, even right. either or, it still saves because DC is fifteen. It's smart enough not to well to ignore whatever you see. Oh, uh, and then like I have the emotional damage. 
Camille, it's, it's your turn. Oh, very fair. Oh, I Question, is, is this a, a, just a, a, the name Fairy Fire? It's not an actual fire, right? No, no it's no. not an actual fire. Yes, that's the cool. name is just... It's a, a disco name. light. <laughs> it's like a firefly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yes, that's key. <laughs> just check it. I forgot about okay, the... Okay, guys. Uh, Fireball will really kill us. <laughs> Uh, can I just pet it? Sex damage. The sex damage? Yeah. yeah, because I hit the block thingy. Oh yeah, you do. But 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 you yeah, you need to roll D6. So that on, is it Jack like, Seven Throw? No no the one the one doesn't have any six hex. Okay. So you just get a D6. Yeah, D6 no no, I mean the fairy fire. No, yeah. just it just lights up like the RGB. No, Jack Seven Throw. DC 15. Yeah, DC 15 on deck yeah. saving throw first, and then it lights up like Razor's mouse. Three. It's gonna be interesting. Dexter. See, let's see what it is. Dexter's on the fight. That was funny. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What's uh, not? Uh, no. <laughs> no, I'm playing to see who. Suddenly. Finally. Suddenly, 20 days. <laughs> oh, no. Like 20. Oh, it got the minus 3 on deck. Yeah, mm. of course. That's what I said. <laughs> that was funny. With dodges. Now oh. I go hide in the corner. Okay, have fun, guys. Oh, what? 20. Oh. oh, its wisdom is minus 2. Oh. Minus 3, actually. Oh, uh, really? Because it says minus 2. For me, it says minus 3. No, no, on wisdom saving, uh, wisdom saving throw. Oh, wisdom of 2. Yeah, it, it's, it has a net 20, but it minus 2. And then, like, the dex is minus 3. So, yeah. Wow, this this thing is very interesting. Jim, mm. if, if, I, if I move back, will I throw at the opportunity? You can disengage. You're no, not engaged. Yeah, that's the thing, Jim. Am I engaged or I'm not engaged yet? Are you uh, married yet? <laughs> <laughs> Well, your your spear is engaged with that, but <laughs> then again, you can just uh, drop the spear and move whatever. Or you can try. Are you seriously going to let that thing take your spear? No, of course not. I'm going to disengage. <laughs> Alright, fine. I just disengage. Uh, and I move back. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, 30 feet, right? Okay, that's it, Emmett. Alright. It is its turn now. Just see, I, I, I actually just, want to burn the thing up. <laughs> you just see a black mass. Oh no! Moving. Uh, it's like a, a tar pit that starts moving out from... It, it doesn't seem natural when you see a black oil that seems to be moving. Or is it a symbiote? <laughs> Oh no. Movie out, out from where it was. Oh no. It's oh, another no. Sony movie. <laughs> do, you, do your job. <laughs> <laughs> a job, obvious. Go and fight. Go and fight him. <laughs> and it will do. <coughs> do the pot. Do the pot. Oh no. 12. It's a mimic. Miss us. No. Misses. No. Oh shit, that's a lot of damage. Five bludgeonings plus 23. Yes. Holy crap. But it could be not a, a mimic because it is a high of creature. Yeah. Elemental. Mm. Bloody right. elementals. <coughs> so it tries to attack the knight, right? Yes. Misses. Yes, it does. Oh no, it's Venom. <laughs> we are Venom. Morbius, go Advantage. to the drop. Go whack. It's wacky, wacky time. Whack, whack, oh, whack. it hits. Oh no, it's going to be corroded. Watching. 
Oh, okay. That's interesting. Oh, what happened? Corrosive. Yep, corrosive form. A, a creature that touched the pudding <laughs> or hit it with a melee attack within five feet of it takes one, uh, four, one, four, eight, four, mm-hmm. uh, four, four, eight. Eight. Oh, 1d8. Mm. Any, yeah. uh, any, 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 non-magical weapon. Any weapon made of metal Corrodes. or wood that hits the pudding corrode. After dealing damage, the weapon takes a permanent and cumulative one penal, uh, minus one penalty to damage rolls. If its penalty drops to negative five, the weapon is destroyed. Non-magical ammunition made of metal or wood that hits the pudding is destroyed after dealing damage. The pudding can eat through two minus uh, no, two, two inch, inch thick, thick. non magical wood. Oh fuck. I have yeah. to ask, is this the hardest we ever fought or the most Careful <laughs> I sense my sword being eaten away by this. I told you to go range <laughs> <laughs> But you did, you command him to do it. <laughs> I did, I told him to. No, you told him as a reminder, yeah. but did you command him? <laughs> well, I think your officers say it must be a... Uh, okay, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 16. Does 16 hit? Yes, it does. Mm. Now the great self has minus 2. Ah. Yep. So, total of 17 point of damage. Good, 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 good. Ah, it's eating me alive! I told you to go range! Why is all the sun? It's attacking me first. I have to defend. By, by the way, GM... Uh... Disengage and use your crossbow! <laughs> uh, uh, a warrior does not run away! You... It's a tactical Man. march backwards. <laughs> uh, by the way, GM, uh, this yep. night... Uh, was this the one that got a net 20 on perception? Hmm? Pardon? Was this night, uh, is this the night that got a net 20 on perception in the cave? Yeah. Ah. No, that's not, that's not the night, GM. Yeah. It is, huh? It isn't. Remember? We, early on. No. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, no. Yeah, yeah, I'm not... asking from previous, uh, campaign. Sorry, no, previous, uh, episode. Like, okay. the one after. There was a knight that got a net 20 on perception. If you remember that, you remember. Yeah. So this is him? Yes. Alright. No, it's not GM. Okay, okay, hold on. Hold on. Uh, your previous uh, day is that it's not, not that person, right? Yeah, it's not that person. You specifically uh, wanted that person to be there with Nips? Yep. Okay, so this is not the person. Ah. Uh. Okay. Okay, one thing that you have that. Ah, splinter. When the pudding. The yeah, splitting into a smaller form. Oh, two. God! It has two now. So, wait. What? Nine, Both seven. glowing RGB? I think no, because it's a new creature. Yeah. Is it DM? Yes. yes. It is a new creature. Two new creatures. Sorry. Split. Uh, whatever. Oh, previous round. Okay, so... But they're smaller, right? Yeah, it is smaller. So, wait. Yeah, uh, let's see. It... The knight attacks it. Uh, and then it was... Slashes. Chen Chen's turn. No, no. It, when... It, I forgot to, to have that because slashing attack. Ah. So... It splits and then passes to Chen Chen's turn. Yes. Ah, okay, so now we have two on our So hands. one is Disco, one is not Disco. Yes, one is not Disco. God damn it. <laughs> okay, now it's Chen Chen's turn. Sorry. Somehow you, st- you, you start figuring out, maybe... Things are so clean because things were have been eaten out. <laughs> that makes sense. So wait, uh, that means anybody here gets eaten up 
and no evidence is found. Oh. Well, it's hard to say. It could be become like fossil, you know, in the car. Probably. 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 Like a fossil. In just like the tempting mound. Okay. Yeah, uh, yeah. Chin chin. All right. I'm it's, gonna do something I've never done before. It's by the way, and it appears to be one. The the new one seems to be nearer to you, as it splits. Oh, strength save. Uh, what's this? Wind wall. Wind wall. Wow, wind wall. Interesting. A wall of strong wind raised from the ground at the point of a choose. Uh, you choose within range. You can make the wall up to thirty. Uh, sorry, fifty foot long, fifteen feet high, and one foot thick. You can shape the wall in any way you choose, as so long as it makes one continuous path along the ground. The wall lasts for the duration. Like uh, this. The wall appears. Each the wall appears. Each creature within must uh, it, it must make a strength saving throw. A creature takes three d8 bludgeoning damage on. A fail save for half as much damage on a successful one. The strong wind keeps fog, smoke, and other grasses at bay. Small or smaller flying creatures or objects can't pass through the wall. Do s- okay, cool. This is this is cool. Yep. Okay, so DC seventeen. Strength save. No lightning or slashing damage, please. Mm. How far can I go, like? But it doesn't push, right? Doesn't push. But it creates a barrier between you and it. Yep. Ah. Fifty. Oh, that's long. I can like get in end to end. That way. Huh? Cool. How do I blow? 30 foot, 15 feet high, 1 foot thick. If it's, even if it's 15 feet high, uh, the hooded figure can, can still see because he's 20, 20 feet yeah. over. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So can I? This is only 30 feet. Like, from this end, uh, if I get from this end to, like, maybe here, it's only, like, 40 feet only. 40? Yeah. yeah, you can just put it at 40 and stuff. I mean, no harm done. Yeah. You, you would like that, lah. Yup. Still, it does the job, so good on that. Okay. So, do you do that? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Alright, All right. you have a wall. Erected wall of the... Yeah, GM said erected. <laughs> <laughs> but still, uh, DC 17 on strength saving throw. So, let's see what you get, sir. Okay. Yep, okay, let's see. Strength saving crew. Strength saving crew. DC 17. <laughs> Take Ooh. half of 9, please. Just plus 3 on strength. This one, let's see. Save. Strike. Oof. On the dot. Mm-hmm. Still, uh, 9. Half tree rounded up. Round up, right? Yep. Five lah. Both, both got five damage. Legioning. Alright. Anything else? And they can. Uh, no. Sorry, yeah. This is. What? What do you mean they cannot? <laughs> they are. They are not windy. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, I think that's all. Bye-bye, Tad. Alright. Mm. It's morning time. <laughs> hey, come, Mort, do your thing. Fight again. From up on your perch, you can see things unfold. And what? as the, the tar starts splitting in two. So, wait. Oh, I, I, I'm not looking at the board right now. But does that mean the knight is trapped in between a wall and the monster? Yep. Nope. Oh yes, I didn't hear that. No. It we didn't. It's like the wall is between the monster and the knight. Oh, okay. So yeah. Okay. 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 <laughs> Again, Eldritch Blast at the disco one. <laughs> okay. Both. With advantage is 20. Sorry, <laughs> probably guy. Don't forget your hacks. Yeah, yeah, hack damage as well. Hack damage stage what? Uh, 6? 1d6. 1d6. So, total of 7. Ah, okay, Two, not bad. 2 force damage and 5 necrotic. Alright. Okay, let me see 11. what I can do. <laughs> you get you get advantage against that? Because of... Uh, Very fire. Yeah, because of Disco Light. Oh, okay. They're still... Okay. One okay. of them. Does Fairy Fire switch after one dies? No, right? I don't think so. So it's not like uh, Hunter's Mark? Hmm? Fairy Fire oh, what? Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Next time I'll do that. And then I'll beauty for the only I can do. Alright, my turn. I shall move north by two blocks. Now I can see this shit's going on. Alright, cool, cool. So, which one is lit up like a disco light? Um, uh, before you start uh, doing anything, oh, okay. can you roll a perception? Me? Alright. Uh, yeah, you. You're covered by the wall. No, uh, it's just that you, you suddenly, oh, a bit of the tar in front of you started sticking to your shoes. Ah, fuck. <laughs> okay, that's it. <laughs> God Go ahead. Damn it. Now I need to clean this. Ah, fuck. Um, with that rage and fury in me, because I need to buy new Pradas, uh, I shall insult it with words. <laughs> shall I insult it with words or should I just shoot? Uh, you know what? Um, shoot. No, wait, give me a second. That should... No. I shall insult it with words. Uh, with words. Yes, here we go. Huzzah! I shall tell it. You need a good scrubbing, dear sir. Okay. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Just, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I said I am receiving the emotional damage. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I am one. Scrub, scrub. <laughs> I am one of receiving. <laughs> Shit. <clears throat> For no time, this is what I want to do. This I want to move twenty feet behind the night. Feet behind the knight. Oh, I reach okay. into my bag and I pass him a mace plus one. <laughs> but, 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 it also oh, where the mace went. Yeah, it, was, it went to him. <laughs> well, what do you happen to the mace? It doesn't even matter because that thing is going to be destroyed. <laughs> no, nah, not magical. Okay. Then I move. Then I move. Okay. Fine. Uh, then I heal. So your action is passing the maze and then bonus action healing. I guess so. Uh, what 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 bonus action heals? Healing words. Healing words. 
Do I have any words? No, I don't. Huh. Seven. Okay. Badan anda sihat. Dan go, mate, go. Okay. I'm trying to double. Anything else? Done, done. So the knight has. So the knight has. He has a miss plus one. Please use it. <laughs> All right. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Non magical. So the miss does survive. All right. Cool, 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 cool. All right. I'm gonna heal the knight by uh, four points. I guess not too much. Uh, what what do you do? Heal him. Yeah, with what? With my special celestial. Special what? I I heal him for four Carl, points. Carl, your mic is further away again. Oh, okay, sorry. Make out can you me. Hear me. Kiss it. I'm sad. Uh, can you hear me? Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. No, no. I I heal I heal him with my special energy. Uh, but D and D terms, healing words, or no, 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 no. Special ability of my class. Ah. Uh. Okay. Uh, and then this one is close to dying. Uh, GM? It's kind of hard for you to to discern whether it's dying or not, mm -hmm. because okay. it is just a black mass swirling, moving, entangling. Ah, uh, god damn it! You know what? Let's. I'm gonna focus on one anyway. Anyway. Not to be too greedy here. Let's focus on one. I'll just blast on the first one. Yes. The advantage, right? Yes. Yes. Yep. Pretty good. Yep. Let's go. Twenty-six and nineteen. Seven. Twenty-one. Twenty-one for force damage, and it gets pushed back twenty feet. As you thought, you want to push it back. It seems like the very nature of it sticking to the ground. It doesn't seem to be moving. Oh no! Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Spider. It's a tar. <laughs> it's sticky. <laughs> yeah. Fair enough. Hmm. Is it flammable? <laughs> <laughs> that is a good question, and I don't I, want to that. I wanted to burn it, but that's, that's the thing. Because if I burn it, right, and then it starts to spread tar all over, and then hopefully it's gonna be on fire. So I was like, oh crap. So like, hmm. Sorry, um, I just have to ask, does shooting through the wall, does shooting through the wall go through or no? No, I think. No, it doesn't. It's a wall of wind. Yeah, so I'm just, okay, I'm mean, just asking because if an arrow goes through, wouldn't the arrow, quote unquote, be at disadvantage? No, it will be blocked by the wall. Mm. Okay. It is in the, in the description of the spell itself. Okay. Really? But Eldritch, Eldritch is fine, right? Eldritch energy. On top. So it won't be a problem. Okay. But yeah, I don't know like, if your Eldritch is... Can it cheat or not? Do you have this question? Uh, it's, uh, it's magical. It's not projectile weapon. Okay. Yay, magic power supreme. <laughs> okay. It is similar I... to conventional... Uh, Versus magical weapon against this kind of the creatures. Mm. Okay. Uh, I am yeah, versus the wall, uh, against the wall also. Ooh, black pudding! It's your turn. Okay. 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 Suddenly it hits. Oh no, Kami got disconnected. Oh, Kami got disconnected. Kami Lisi, oh no. Kami Lisi is trying to hit the knight? Yes, it does. Hit the knight. Ah, uh, do I? Do I? Or Kam does Kami do it? Shoot. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna save my stuff. Oh no. I'm still flustered from my shoe getting damaged. Ah. In one fell swoop, it's almost engulfing the knight. 
with all the black ichor uh, sticking and entangling and corroding whatever weapon, other weapons, the non-medical weapons and armor that the knight is wearing. The knight screams in pain at, as he's almost eating away at whatever vestments that he's wearing. Mm, that's not good. Oh, it's the other one. <coughs> it's oh, no. also do. It's also doing his attack. Mm. <laughs> no, another thirty-four. Ooh. Bye, bye, night. Oh no. And it is being engulfed by simply the black black pudding as it disappears into the, the mass of swirling tendrils that's eating into whatever that it came into contact with. I'm you can just... see the smoke. <laughs> can oh. I type a cutting word? Uh no. The pseudo port attack was at 24. Cutting word doesn't cut it. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. I think, I think it's a, in a moment of distraction. Yeah, you got cut off, right? <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. True. <laughs> yeah, it's a moment of distraction. Oh, the, the yeah. pseudo port is the engulfing one. Ah, okay. Yeah. Actually, right. both. Yeah, both are engulfing. <laughs> ah. Both oh, are munching no. in the on the same stuff. Oh no, it's eating him and then it's gonna eat me. Oh no. Come on, Chen Chen, you can do it. Come on, Chen Chen, be the tank. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but does it, is they are still taking like three D eight force them bludgeoning damage, right? From the wall uh, the wing wall? Uh roll. Is it a roll? It, is it during have... your turn, right? Uh, they have to make a strength deck, uh, right? Alright, okay. Uh, yeah, they, strength is... Strength saving throw, right? Okay. Yeah, uh, no. Okay, let me do that. And they fail, only they get the damage. Okay, so that fails. This Top guy... The damage. And this guy will do that thing. Uh, wait, sorry. Um, I'm reading oh. here. It says, when the wall appears, each creature within its area must make a strength saving throw. A creature takes blah blah blah, but says it when the wall appears. So oh, only appears, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So it doesn't, ah. Doesn't Technically, la. doesn't. I'm not sure if it gets pushed back or not because, uh, not sure. The strong wind keeps no. fog, smoke, and other oh. gases at bay. Small or smaller flying creatures or objects can't pass through the mm. wall. Yeah. Small or small it's... flying creatures. Oh, uh, are they small? No, no. they are gigantic. So they can pass through without any problems. I see the, the yeah. thing I'm reading here. Yeah. The, okay. So the stress saving through is only when it start appearing. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's what it says. Okay. Uh huh. Oh, magic players here. <laughs> <laughs> All the rules, lawyer. I mean, Baldur's <laughs> yeah, yeah. came out. Yes, right. so, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, now I want to get a clock of bats. Do you have it, sir? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Chad. Your turn. All right. Many things. <laughs> Kabel, <kabel>, buruk siku. <laughs> <coughs> Loot ma. That's uh, okay. Now it's just weird. Like us. And then it, So, but why would it last for like one minute? Like one minute is how many? Like how Six many rounds? Round? If I remember right. Okay. Yeah. Um, they and only block for small creatures and projectiles to go through. Yeah, small and small flying creatures. Alright, never mind. Sorry, so, uh, so one, one minute is 10 rounds. Okay. Yep, yep. Alright, just, just, just need to remember that. One minute is 10 rounds. Okay, cool. So, total the that again. <sighs> you can cancel your concentration anytime if you want. Yep. So do you cancel? Uh, yeah. 
I'm just cancel my consultation. Cast told her that. This one. Alright. Initial black pudding. Wisdom saving 10. Uh, hex on this is wisdom, right? Yeah, wisdom. wisdom. Okay. But we, we, start, we uh, establish that not saving throws. Yeah, it's not saving throws. It's only for. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's not too OP, like Hex. Yep. Okay. Yep. okay. Ooh, 15. Almost. Still fails. <laughs> almost. Okay. So. It takes that's 10 it. point of necrotic damage. Oh, no. It takes. Uh, since it's level 5, it takes 2d8. Already? Counted? Yeah, yeah, I already. Alright, cool. So it is suffering 10. 2d12? Yeah, yeah, it's already 2d12. 10. Another d12. No, no, it's already. No, it's already, no, it's, it's already completed. Oh, okay, 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 right. You notice the that particular black pudding is shrinking and it is being attacked with all the the, the magical attacks that you have. Concentrating on it. <coughs> Run away! Me get all spooky! The chain gonna move back here. Alright, and I'm gonna. Where's my shit? Cast healing words on myself. Yay! As a bonus action. Then you are healed. Okay, yeah. let me then that will be my turn. Alright. Did you fire still on effect? Oh yeah. Yep, yep. Shoot this go. Magic Blast, 21, to hit, 8 force damage. On to this, right. Blast Hex. On to that motherfucker, the Disco one. Okay. And then another Hex damage, 3. 3 Necrotic. Nice. Alright. All the buffeting of the Eldritch Blast uh, started. Cutting it to pieces, bit by bit, and it started shrinking in size. Ooh, that's good. I uh, will EOT for now. Give me a second, I'm reading something. Uh, uh, does it mean Master Zerum became pudding food? Probably. Ah, damn. We don't know. There's, there's nothing here, you know, we're looking at... Or he might have been trapped in that crystal we left behind. Uh, it's also a possibility, but they mm -hmm. say they never went to this this area, right? True, true. Yep. Okay, so looking at the situation right now, it's Fubar because they dirtied my shoe. Also, they killed the knight. Yes, that, that is also an important factor. <laughs> Priority. <Yes>. Priority. <laughs> so, I... I am pissed off right now, really pissed off. And I point my finger at them and I say, light him up. Um, I'm not 100% sure if anybody noticed this, but uh, I cast this oh, at no. level 2. Fireball? That <laughs> only on reaction, ma. I also can cast it normally. No, no, no. Hmm? On oh. reaction. Is it only on reaction spell? Show spell description. Yes. The, the, the casting time is reaction. One reaction. Sorry. One reaction. Uh, what's this? Uh, it's only on your reaction if you get hit. Oh, yeah. no. Uh, how does one click this? Yes. One reaction. I've been a tiefling for a long time, so I know. So I cannot cast this anytime I want? It's on no, the reaction? No, only on reaction, yes. Only if someone hits you. Ah, okay. <sighs> okay. So it Throw doesn't... Molotov. No, <laughs> those things are money. <laughs> well, okay. But you're pissed off, right? You, you, you're more pissed off than... 
Yeah, but money, I'm right? also thinking of money. I'm like Mr. Oh. Krabs. Money. Oh, <laughs> well, you know, you can you can just kill them and then you just take their tar. <laughs> but I need to process <laughs> it to I become can. oil. Uh, so, anywho, um, that is what I think in my head that I want to do. <laughs> but in reality, I take out my hand crossbow and I shoot it. I shoot the one, this one. And since it's growing like a disco ball, uh, I have advantage. Uh, take, advantage. So it's 22. Sneak attack. I did. No, no. On no sneak attack. Sneak attack. No, yeah, it, on advantage, like, auto sneak attack. Oh, yeah. okay, okay. Forgot about that. So, yep. um, sneak attack is a d4, right? No, it's a d6. Uh, give me a second. Oh my goodness. Sneak attack. 26, so I just rolled this 6. Why did it pop up? Oh, huh, strange. One. Nine point of damage. That will show him. And the cost will both melt away. Alrighty then. So GM. Alright. It takes nine point of damage. Hmm. It'll show him who's boss. Right, anything else? Uh, I'll, uh, as a bonus section, I shall move. Nah, uh, move 30 feet. Here. You just taken your movement? Nope, I haven't. So, okay. Right, and then you can I take will... a bonus section to dash. Oh, yeah. Can do. Uh, I'll take another extra 15 to run next to Carl. And I shall end the turn. Okay. What uh, the? What the? <laughs> well, uh, your footprints leave a trail of black tar and on one it. of your shoes. My Pradas. They will pay for this. Oh. Oh. Kamil's shooting. Pew pew. Pew pew, the disco ball. Alright. <clears throat> so, call it. Yay. By the way, um, fairy Egan. fire check. How well, doesn't really matter, but fire fairy fire? How many turns left? I don't know. Gone. Mm, okay. Is it gone? Yeah, it's dead. It's gone. Mm, okay. Gone by the wind. Gone by the tar. Wait, wait, what? Why why Camille? Wait, wait, dead? What, 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 Camille, why, is, what? why is Camille <laughs> Camille, why are you dead? <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh the I use the HP bar for the Duration of uh, oh. Terrifier, but at the same time, my character sheet uses the red circle to link my HP to my token. <laughs> <laughs> mm, uh, okay. the, the red circle is memang the HP bar punya. Okay. <laughs> Why is it did? Why is it did? I thought I thought GM GM did it on the. If you <laughs> want to use it, I use the blue circle. Oh no no no! <laughs> use use the middle one, the green one, the the nothing value. Uh, sorry, the, the green one. That is the temporary uh, HP. My goodness! I know, right? I thought I thought, I thought GM. I'm like, <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> what happened? And uh, this is being recorded. I even GM was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, GM, so mean. Why are you so mean? <laughs> GM said, "You kill one of my pudding. I will not take your own pudding." <laughs> Okay, fix. <laughs> no, Camille, you're still, you're still cross. Yeah, you're still dead. <laughs> you're still dead. Yeah, pick on your token and then just revise your HP. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> I'm like thinking, why is he... Why, why is he keeping taking damage? <laughs> are you committing seppuku? Sudoku! Yeah, are you committing seppuku or something? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, can we anything else? Uh, after that shot, um, I shall take cover and end, and end my turn. Right. Okay. Right. <sighs> Give me a second, I need to think. Uh, you can hey, Jeff, uh, near, near, near this thing, there's no tar, right? It is it, a tar. It is, well, there is a stain of black. Uh, have a liquid from the tar pit. So, so it's connected to the huge tar pit, right? Seems like it. Ah, <laughs> oh, goddammit, I, I can't use fire. If I use fire, the whole thing is gonna burn for 
for months. But we never know. <laughs> it is raw oil. It might not be combustible. Well, you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> Eldritch Blast. Net one. And then <laughs> become fireball. <laughs> nope. Different. Uh, Eldritch Blast hits, hits. And then total of 25 points of damage. Uh, yep. Does it push back if I'm not mistaken? Nope. Jam stick doesn't push back. Hmm. Mm. It seems to be a unique situation because it's sticking. It's very sticky. <laughs> yeah, I gotta move back. Uh, and my turn. Alright. No, it's the pudding's turn. <laughs> pudding. The truth is in the pudding. <laughs> you know, right? I'm just thinking that this could be owned by the tree. No, by, by the dwarves. I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> The main, the, the evil guy. That's why. That's why I I put a uh, night night with uh night night with our friend there just mm. in case. Because I I don't trust the uh, dwarves. They are a bit suspicious. It attacked Chen Chen for eleven. Oh no, eleven! It misses on both yeah. accounts. <laughs> yep. And it will. And it's turn. Uh, this is dead already. Okay. Oh, Chen Chen. Chen, you are face to face with that black mass in front of you. Mm. It's smaller, but it's still a mass. Uh, is it still considered large, medium, or small? It, now, now I think it's a medium. Medium, all right. So... Getting getting smaller. Okay. Ding 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 ding. Okay. It has been hit before, right? Uh huh. It's many times. Okay. It is a uh, yellow, orange in color. Told the dead. Okay. <coughs> nope, I'm gonna stay away. How, how far should I run? How far should I run? One, two. Don't forget to disengage if you. <laughs> okay, no, you forgot. Oh. Alright, you did not disengage. <laughs> okay. So it takes an attack of opportunity. As you try to move away from it, it misses. <laughs> it tries to have extend one tendril towards your direction, but it's too slow. Yes, it is. It's too slow, and it's small. <laughs> <laughs> no medium. Remember medium, small, yeah. small. As it, it, no, as it that the tendril extended but it doesn't reach. <laughs> All right, you manage to we from it. Elven Grace. <laughs> <laughs> By the grace of the Bala. To the radiant damage. The best thing is to the dead. To the dead. Hadouken. Ding dong. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. But it needs oh, to make wow. a wisdom save of 17. Yep. So let's go oh, and wait, see. Oh wait, actually you don't, you don't add the wisdom modifier. For the total of the dead. No, really? Huh? Yeah. Hey. So it's 12 damage only. No, it's not. Mm. It's not double because he's level five. Uh, yeah, but he 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 she's not supposed to add uh the Mister Modifier inside, in, inside the total of the dead. Is it the yeah. Oh, the damage. So it's just uh two D twelve. Yeah. Just two D twelve. Oh. Yeah. It's okay. We wait for the wisdom save first. Not Seven fails. Fails. Oh, So never mind. Long, roll two D twelve. I guess. Twelve. Are you sure? Sorry, no, I'll roll 2d12. Yeah, yeah, it's 12 um, damage. No, no, it's 12 damage. Really? 12 damage. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Is that the final it, answer? Yeah, yeah. How do Call you it. do it? Oh. Right. What? Wait, seriously? Yeah, oh, this yeah. is the clone. Da, 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 da. Uh, this is the smaller of the half. <laughs> so I point to the creature and say, Die, motherfucker, die. Very creative. <laughs> Very creative. <laughs> Oh god. Uh, I, I go I, I go check up on the dead night. <laughs> with that I, I, I look around and see are we okay in, are we in the clear? Because <laughs> turn order still there boys. Oh shit, really? Yep. Yep. Okay, then, then, then I can't move yet. <laughs> As you finally get your bearing and you start getting your all your wisdom to check around. Neil, move back. Turn order's not done yet. <laughs> 
Okay, now it's done. And finally, okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go check. Let's go check. I need to check on the night. See if I can still save him. Yeah. Okay, can I still save the night or he's really dead though? Um, first thing it's first, okay. investigate the pile of tar. I move one yeah, back because I don't want to get my products to teeth. <laughs> Alright, what are you looking at? Uh, what looking at looking at this thing and trying to figure out if there's any remnants of bodies and whatnot. It doesn't seem to be any remnants that you look at. And it, if there's any, you expect it to be corroded already or totally melted. Mm, okay, so... Even bones. Mm, that's not great. So, let's check up on this one next. Uh, come here, you want to do your investigation? Do I roll? Yes. GM, does he roll? Yes, yes he does. Hmm. Okay, so roll. Alright, All right. what are you looking at? What are you investigating? I'm looking for the plus one maze. Mm. <laughs> well, tentatively you look and you try to avoid some of the corrosive that's still remaining liquid. Um, and lo and behold, you found a plus one. Well, you, you found a maze. You found a maze? Yeah. <laughs> Is it the plus one? Is it still magical? <laughs> Well, the it it looks it, well. It 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 still shines with a uh, some sort of energy that you can detect, even though even the the wooden formal is still intact. Oh, it's a power weapon. Ooh, magic. Yeah. yeah. Shit. The 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 knight is dead. Is dead, right, Jim? I can't find him really. Right? No, well, you just notice a uh, uh, like a black. Smear on the floor. Oh no. <sighs> Not even a body to bury. So sad. Alright. Anything else that you want? Oh. Well, I guess. Okay, okay. Uh, Leonel, investigate this block, right? Sorry, uh, yeah, I, I, I investigate this block there, yeah. By the way, yeah, GM, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll take a look at the other block, yes. I'm here, and do I. See any entrance to a passage, or is this just wall? Uh, it's just a wall. It seems to. It looks like a a natural wall area that is uh, good to be fortified. It can be fortified if you have want to make create a storage area. This is a good place. Hmm. Okay. Fascinating. Uh, Jim, I'm gonna try to investigate this uh this path. Oh, okay, interesting. Uh, let's see. Where where are you? Okay, you're all over the place. I'm trying to find. Okay, where? Okay, what are you looking at? Uh, investigate this path. For, okay. For Ooh, pretty high. Well, out of the pile, it's a smaller pile, but you you notice something. You notice there is a. It seems to be an amulet of sort. Ooh, I pick it up. And also a bracer. Okay, pick the bracer up as well. Do, do, does it have any symbol or whatnot? It's still dirty. Hmm, okay. Alright, uh, Morbius, you, are, you have a history. You, you are very well schooled. You know... Uh, a lot of the the most the monstrous city that that uh, emanates that that also haunts this very realm. So, what are you looking at? What are you looking for, but in particular, fire knowledge on the monster, be it the substance that it left can be used or not, and then then he left. That's a general knowledge of the monster. Okay, most of it is 
what is left after it is done, uh, it is killed, is just mostly useless things. It will corrode as it eats. Mm-hmm. And yeah. most of the things that is left are the ones that is usually magical in nature. All right. So I do know what is this monster, all right? Yes. Uh, monster manual. Volo edition. <laughs> Volo edition. <laughs> um, guys, I just checked out the place and it's rather empty and there's no way to move around or anything. Like, honestly speaking, I feel like this is a setup. Yeah, just, eh, who set up who? Yeah, it just seems to be the case. I I asked the I asked one of the guards, one of the knights to Which knights? Guard. There's no yeah. more knights, right? One is no, there's no knights. One. Yeah, I asked I asked the guard the knight to guard needs. Hopefully, you know, he's safe. Lah. Okay. Yeah. But here's okay. the thing, right now, um Okay, right now. I think we should sneak out and check because if they're setting us up, that means they could have been the one that is behind this all and whatnot. Um, and looking at the area here, it's like if this was a mining town for oil, it's either been cleaned up by those monsters or I, I don't know um something because it's too clean and these frog creatures the dwarves should have told us about them at least and yeah, this it, it does it does seems that they are luring us to a trap we need to get back now let's go but i okay before that let me go up ahead first to sneak in and just well cough them, uh, catch them off guard camille follow me and go invisible Okay. A tree! <laughs> and, and with that, uh, we... Uh, oh, let's go. I, I, I shall go with you as well. Let's go. Yeah, but you have to stay way behind. Uh, no, no, I'm, I'm going with you. No, no, I mean, we want to sneak in and see if they were plotting something. Because if you go in and reveal our... Well, uh, reveal our location and find out that they were tricking us or whatnot, we won't find that out. So, anywho... Going to stealth so, my way out. Okay. So, uh, Yona is stealth. So, marching order will be... Uh, Camille will be in front, going invisible. I'll be behind him uh, a few feet. And... Carl and the rest will be behind me by 30 feet or 60 feet. Alright, let's go. <coughs> oh, oh, it's okay. <laughs> oh. Chen. Uh, he, is, he, has time, he has time to sell, but, but he is very loud. <laughs> Morbius is also in this cool. Oh. And it's just net 20. Okay. okay. So basically. Okay. Um, without my knowledge, Morb will be going in front. <laughs> without anyone knowledge, I will, you don't know where I am. No. Chen you Chen. know what? I'll just burn a level 3 spell slot and make Chen Chen invisible as well. For the fun of it. <laughs> <laughs> but it's gonna be loud. <laughs> Wait, sorry. Um, How many people does this affect? Oh, wait. Because can you can you come in? Invisibility is a concentration spell now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, concentration, but you know, it says if I use a special level 3, I can target one additional creature. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Ah, so basically... Chen Chen, are you willing? <laughs> How can you say no to that voice? <laughs> If you don't want to go sneaky sneaky, I'll save my spell slot. 
<coughs> is waiting on you. I just saw Camille went. One of you guys went invisible, and then I turned myself into invisible. <laughs> Mm. Ah, invisible je lah. Okay, level 3. Chen Chen is invisible. Alright, okay. So, are you guys ready? Yep, going in. Returning yep. returning back to the camp? Mm-hmm. Yep. Alright. Yep, let's go. Alright, so before we all rush, bum rush in, uh, uh, Camille shit. will be front. So is Morb. I shall be behind back a bit. Uh, Chen Chen can decide what he wants to do. <laughs> you don't know what to do. I'm just saying because the, yeah. since you're invisible, uh, I, I'm assuming you'll be in front of us. So Camille uh, should be in front as planned, and Chen, I don't know, should you? I'm going to be loud. Okay, Maybe so I'm invisible. <laughs> uh, you can stay away. <laughs> oh, you get a sixteen on stealth, and Chen, but are you invisible? So you arrive back at the the camp, the base camp. Oh, sorry. Uh, the the vision thing doesn't affect here. Okay. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> uh, was was getting used to it already. Shit. <laughs> no, I'm not used to it. Uh, it's like playing a video game. All right. So we 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 stealthily scout out the camp. And all right, go on, go on, go on, go on, go on, go on. Go on. All right, um, I pop up. Uh, or I stand next to Carl. Carl, they're gone. Oh shoot! I I I I check the piles of blood. Yeah. What what Jam? Do I find bodies or? It's quite fresh. Is that is that a trail? That doesn't seem to be. All right. So there, there are. It seems to be okay. Um, can you roll investigation? Uh, I'll help Carl. Carl, you want to do it? Sure, let's do it. Okay, I'll help you. Oh, this not good. Twenty. Seems to be a lot of track. But where, more than heading? more than one. Where's it heading to? Uh, it seems to... well. The snow seems to indicate that uh, is. A convergence of lots of tracks that seems to be going here and there. Seems to be a chaos. I'm going to go up here a bit. The blood, the, the blood tracks. Where are they heading towards? It seems to be going northwards. Do I Probably. see any tracks yeah, towards this place or? Yes. So Leona seems to detect that the the there are fresh tracks, northwards. Right. Son of a bitch. Let's go. But there 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 are, there are no bodies, right? You don't seem to to see any. Just blood. So there's a chance that the nips and the knights are still alive. Probably. But anywho, guys, um, I see tracks going north. It could be going back to the caves. So, I stand next to Morb and ask. Would you like to join us for this one? Can you see me? Oh. Yeah. Oh yeah, because snow tracks. So. Oh, snow track. Camille, would you like to join us for this? Um, Camille, follow us. We need to go to the north. Lego. Wait, what? Oh. <laughs> You're there. Oh, oh. Let's go for more. So wait. Uh, who are we talking to? Uh, suddenly, you you hear a voice, but you cannot see who the heck you're <laughs> talking. <laughs> Invisible, eh? Here. Then walking on the on the wall. <laughs> talk to talk to this person. Suddenly, voice comes out here. Like, what the fuck? No, no, I, I didn't say anything. <laughs> no, no, I'm I'm saying that I see tracks coming here. Talk to uh, Camille, and then Camille's voice comes here. Like, what the fuck? Uh, yeah, 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 understandable. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. But but anywho, um, um, person. Vampire person, would you like to join us for this one? I guess I'll tag along with you, Dimwit. What the fuck? Why is coming here? <laughs> uh, actually, 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 I'm also invisible. 
So you, you you're talking you're talking to an invisible people. Everyone's invisible. Wait, so no, you... are you invisible? How? I'm Who gives invisible. you invisibility? <laughs> no, how no Carl, how how are you? Nobody gave you invisibility. Oh well, you know. GM gave me invisibility. <laughs> Right. Well, well, right. uh, well. At, at least, well. Uh, okay, okay, so okay. He, he, here's the situation. Um, somebody thought he is invisible. <laughs> <laughs> he treats like himself as invisible, but everybody can see him. Except, what? yeah. <laughs> apparently, everybody can, can can see you. You you thought you are invisible. But I, I but I I am invisible. I use my spell. What I, spell? I, I don't see any spells here. I message my GM. Oh God. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I know that you. Yeah, anyway. Uh, yeah, no, no, it's, I, going funny. it's going funny. It's going funny. Thinking, I'm invisible. <laughs> Turns out you, you are not. <laughs> nah, the only person that can be invisible without magic is Felix. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's go. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, di- let's end uh, this adventure here. Okay. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, no. We need to, we need to save Nip. No, it's yeah, just, uh, GM, GM, GM. At least let us go up north a bit and then cliffhanger. Well, though, uh, let's let's end here. Ah, uh, the same way. I haven't haven't prepared yet. Okay. <laughs> no, no, no. Shit. I I I I, sh- I shouldn't have left Nips Nips there because I, I thought I thought Nips would be safer outside. Turns out it wasn't. That's opposite. Ah, <laughs> uh, let's end at the let's end the cliff at the cliffhanger right here. Hey 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 hey. Ah, I'm wondering did I make a right decision? Put, put the knight outside. No, no, no. Honestly, that I would have done the same thing, but except with two knights. But I don't understand why you wanted to bring in the extra knight. So, uh, honestly, strategically wise, you did good. But uh, we got no idea. We got no idea how many people are around. Why, why we needed the extra knight? Extra cannon fodder? <laughs> you did, yeah. Well, because, because if not, there will be a dead chen chen there. <laughs> 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 True. <laughs> so uh, I, 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 we, we, we need a melee, melee guy in our team, but there's no melee guy in our team. Oh, I need, no, uh, we, we didn't know that we we're gonna fight something corrosive. So yeah. And and GM, GM well, they, well, can, they can they can split <laughs> they yeah. can yeah. split upon slashing. GM well done, uh. you, you you played us all. Slashing <laughs> and lightning. Exactly. Yep, yep. No but one now, just any um, damage. Man. <laughs> I would like to cast lightning, but that is a level seven spell for me. Oh, I do have a lightning spell. Mm. <sighs> lightning damage. So, so, so we were we were tricked by two two nasty dwarves. Huh? But they 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 played the long game. They played the long game. Well, they really waited for us, huh? Son of a bitch. I mean, honestly speaking, they play smart because if they knew about the werewolf flare. Then they would have just let us go with uh, confidence that we will die. But we come back, survive, and yeah. Damn. Ah, boy. Okay. Well, um, we did see that there's a lot of footprints, right? GM? Yeah. Yes. yes. So meaning... Oh, God. Alright, alright. Can't say much. Have to wait for next week. Sorry, um... Okay, before we head in into uh, the... What you call this? Uh, into the north. The, un- the unknown. Yeah. I suggest the that unknown. we... I suggest that we take a short rest and heal up for a bit. Uh, Camille, you want to play Song of Rest? Tralila Song of Rest. So both of us do that, and we can increase life points like crazy. Okay. To whoever yeah. needs it. But, mm. but, but uh, anyone wounded? No, just need uh, devils. Okay, because because we are we are actually trying to chase chase them, you know. While oh really? Fresh. Remember, we we are trying to follow the tracks. Mm. Yeah, yeah, but uh, true, but still, oh, god dang it. All right. Tapola, we just rush, bum rush. Okay, that's for next week. Yeah, we need to save Nips, Nips, right? <laughs> our, our good friend. Yes, we need to save Nips and Nips alone. 
Uh, I, I, I can't believe two dwarves managed to take down... No, 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 no. It's not two. They yeah, were many four prints. So we got no idea what we're dealing with. They for got ambushed. All, for all we know, we could be fighting Vox Machina. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> <sighs> okay. okay. Now, if there's a mama wolf, that means there must be a daddy wolf. No, man, that bitch ain't coming. <laughs> but anywho, GM, what do we get for this week? Right. Uh, you, you managed to get whatever that you have, the the items that you have found mm-hmm. and recovered and discovered. Uh, secondly, each one of you managed to get eight hundred XP each. Nice. And each one of you uh, managed to snare 50 XP for role-playing. Nice. Right. Well, 850 total, right? Yes, 850, 850. total each. Yeah. So, anything else? Not uh, enough to level up. Not enough. Good, sir. I don't think so. Mine, no. Not yet. Wait, uh, let me check. Long way to go. Yep, yep. Uh, boys, still, still. GM, uh, is there a library in Daggerford? I need 14,000, so I need... Uh, yes. I need, mm. hey, I need 1,000 more, and I can get to level level 6. Yay! Nice. <laughs> I think you are the, the remaining original party. Yeah, I'm the only guy left. <laughs> the rest of them are either dead or gone. No, um, technically Camille is also uh, part but he's of... much more sooner than us. Uh... Yeah, he entered later than us. Slightly, yeah. Camille, Slightly... Camille, and, Camille and I are the original <laughs> party. Yeah, true, true that. Yeah, yeah. Now that I think about it, yeah, that's true. Also, <laughs> Chen Chen, Chen Chen came in about the right time too. Right? Right after Camille. After Camille yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. So. The only original ones here are Camille, no, uh, Camille and Carl and Chen Chen. What did he go on, Chen Chen, Chen Chen, what? Are you talking about the werewolf guy? No, no, no. I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about original party members. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, th- this is a very interesting team dynamic. <laughs> I I I actually I found found interesting that we got two of everything, you know. There's two warlocks. <laughs> two bards. There was two knights. <laughs> now it's <laughs> two knights, yeah. Yeah. Oh by the way, uh uh Neebs, he's a cleric. Now we might have two werewolves as well. Probably? Yeah. yeah. Who, who, who is that doing? What one female one? Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, boys. God. You can you, you can uh, you can start a new anime Werewolf X Family. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh man! Like I I have a strong feeling you guys wanted to play Darkstalkers. <laughs> Forget about being a vampire, become a succubus. Ada <laughs> ada. So I hope you you enjoy tonight's session. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Much fun. Yeah, lo- at. Yeah, and a, and a very how say this uh, we got a we got played we got, <laughs> we got, we got played. played yeah shit we cannot Wait. play horribly oh the body's gone too yeah the the the, the mama the vampire is gone Papa. sorry the vampire yeah. oh no but there's no vampire here <laughs> that we know yeah. of the vampire is back in Daggerford yeah but I but I did break her body. Like, what did GM say? I did it break. No, you cut her up. <laughs> I didn't cut her up, I broke, broke her up. You know? GM, what did you say? <laughs> oh, boys. But yes, um, that will be next week's problem. This will be very interesting. I can't wait. But to be fair, there was no signs at all that they were that they were lying, you know, because we were I, we did an inside check and whatnot. It seems to be legitimate. Our lying. checks were not high enough. Uh, well, we I think I think I rolled eighteen, but it wasn't high, I guess. Well, no, so if, maybe if you if you really think about it, right? Their story about 
the caves did not match what we uh, saw inside. Also, if they were really go wanting to help, they would have gladly come with us and tell us that uh, here's here and then there's there and then like lead us in. But yeah, they, they were, didn't. They really adamant. Yeah. And also, so the we same... have a higher chance that actually Zora might be in the Nether Crystal. Probably. But yeah, because, because we did see a guy in a rope. In the crystal, so... Really? Did you? Yeah, we did. Oh, yeah. But you, but you don't know. We, we knew, but you didn't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Nobody told me. And then, like, Morbius here didn't really explain what the fuck he wants. <laughs> give yeah, I, give I me your plan. You. Give I, me your blood. Yeah, you I said, give me your blood. I need uh, oh, sorry, I need the blood of fire resistor to unprison the guy that. that yeah, but, but, but you start off with give me your blood. <laughs> that's just how I. That's just how. Yeah, yeah, no, no, it we're, is. we're not blaming. The we're, message we're, was lost, bro. <laughs> after, after one was like, yeah. "What the heck?" <laughs> yeah, we, we're not blood. blaming your character. We're just blaming the way that it's worded, <laughs> and yeah, also yeah, yeah, yeah. our our uh, character knowledge. Like, fuck you, motherfucker. <laughs> I first you play. <laughs> so I mean, uh, <laughs> you can't blame the character for thinking how they want to think because yeah, 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 yeah. You know, because like if somebody comes up to me, dear sir, I need your blood. Like fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not even dear sir. It's like you stupid person. I need your blood. <laughs> and, yeah, and, that, he, he, and that person looks pasty as heck. <laughs> And then, and, then, and, then, and then someone said, like, you bloody mongrel. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, holy shit, I'm not giving you my blood. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah. <laughs> what are you going to do with it? <laughs> I can, can go for blood donation. <laughs> but uh, not for you. Can't, can't blame us. That is true, that is true. <gasps> can't, can't blame the characters, man. Can't blame the characters. Yeah, I, 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 I know what you want to do, but just that, uh, you know, yeah. I'm just gonna role play this, <laughs> role play this off as like, holy crap, we have a running home. Yep. <laughs> we might, we might have broken something ancient. I was like, does he have a tentacle? <laughs> oh my god. Actually, just said, I touched something big. <laughs> <laughs> so you see. <laughs> you touched something big. Please, des- please do describe how big was it. <laughs> In excruciating detail. Mm, Jim, can you can you help describe it? <laughs> How big was it? Okay. Need to sign off the recording first. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> 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 <laughs>